Hey y'all, it's Super Dave, and today I'm going to be doing a review on this mini projector here. This mini projector is mainly made for kids, is what the company says, but it can also, anybody can use it. If you just need a cheap TV, you can use this projector instead. It's 1080p. And I'm going to show you the screen size, the quality, the brightness, and all that. Now, this projector, this mini projector, you can connect it to HDMI, USB port. It's got a connection for a SD card in there. If you have some movie, there's something in there, you can connect it there. But I'm going to be showing you today that you can connect it to a laptop, I'll be showing you that first. And then I'm gonna show you how you can connect it to your iPhone so you can watch movies on Netflix, YouTube, or whatever. The best way to do it is use your iPhone, Android. And I'm gonna put a link in the description uh, exactly where you can get a cable, a lightning cable to HDMI uh, connection. So you can hook right to the projector and you can watch your movies on Netflix, YouTube, or wherever you want to watch. So I'm going to be opening it now and show you exactly what you get. Okay, now when you open this mini projector here, you're going to get the user manual. You're going to get a remote. It's an infrared remote. You just point at the back of the projector. I'm going to show you the menu options and all that on there. You're going to get, of course, your your plug here to plug in the projector. It's going to come with your HDMI uh, connection. You can hook this straight to your computer and you could uh, broadcast through the projector. Or what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use this device here and I'm gonna hook it to the uh, USB to HDMI, the lightning cable that is made for the iPhone. I'm going to hook this to that so I can stream my iPhone through the projector. And then you also get this here. This is uh, audio, video input, uh, depending, you know, what you're connecting or whatever. And then, of course, we've got the projector here. I mean, look how, look how small the projector is. I mean, look, it fits right in my hand. You've got your USB, you've got your HDMI, you've got your memory card, and then over here, it's got a spot for uh, headphones, you got your charging jack, and what have you. So, this here on top is, uh, gonna, you're going to adjust the focus on the projector. Uh, now let's uh, hook it up to the laptop and uh, let's see how the picture looks. Okay, now I've got the projector hooked up, power is on and everything. You're going to want to hook up your HDMI cable there. I'm going to run it up here to the computer and I'm going to plug the HDMI into the computer and here's the projector. It's already focused pretty much. It's a, it's a good, good size screen there. Okay, I've got the computer starting up there. I've got the projector hooked up to it. And here's the screen here. You're gonna wanna go on the remote, go to source. I already have it on HDMI. It's got the audio video, the USB, and the TF, which is a memory card. So we're on the HDMI. The computer's starting up here and we should be able to see the screen here in a minute. Here's the screen on the computer, broadcasted on there. I'm gonna turn off the lights, we're gonna see how it looks. Okay, that's with the lights off there. It's got a really good picture, it's uh, 1080p at 60 hertz. The screen size right there on my wall is equivalent to about a 60 inch TV. That's about how big it is. You can go out a little further, a little bit bigger, but if you go any further out than that, it's going to start to get a little unfocused, a little blurry. But that's probably about the biggest 
screen size with the best high definition as you're going to get right there. So here I have a little shark puppet on YouTube broadcasting on the screen here. So as you can see, the screen looks really good on the picture here. Depends what quality you set your YouTube uh, on also. And I have it just playing through the regular speakers on the laptop. So if you can hook some external speakers to your laptop, uh, you're going to get a lot better sound. All right, now I'm gonna show you how you can hook, hook up your iPhone uh, to the HDMI. You're going to need to order one of these here. It's HDMI uh, to a lightning cable here. You're gonna to wanna to plug this into your phone like so. Then you're going to plug this in to the HDMI port it's on the bottom of your phone but then also after that you need to have your uh, USB charging cable or else this will not work so you're going to want to plug it into here this is also so it will charge your phone while you're watching movies or whatever so I plug that into there and this you can just go ahead and plug it into the back of the projector because it does have a USB or you can plug it into your regular USB charger uh, that goes in the wall. Either way it will work. So I'm going to plug it into the back over here of the projector. Okay now once you've got it plugged in it's going to look like this. I'm going to go ahead and turn off the lights now so we can see when it plays see how the picture is going to look okay now you can see the picture there i'm going to uh, click to go ahead and play this movie trailer here okay now it does have a small speaker built in to the back of the projector now you can see this is how the screen looks here the picture looks really good And this is the video on Netflix here. Let me introduce myself. I'm Katie. I'm sort of a weirdo. My parents haven't figured me out yet. To be fair, it took me a while. But you can also play Bluetooth if you want it louder. But the projector has a good sounding speaker. You just want to set it up for your kids. And look at the, this, a lot of brightness. Good sized picture. The sound is good. And this here again is with the lights on. Of course, you want to have a little movie night for the kids, you're going to want to have the lights off. Like I said, the screen right here, how I have it right now, is equivalent to about a 55 or a 60 inch right here on the wall. And right here, I have the PS4. Uh, connected to it as you can see the screen there I'm gonna turn off the lights we'll see how it looks it's playing through the speaker that is built into the projector so this is the picture now on uh, PlayStation here so check out the screen uh, it looks very good very quality color uh, with the PlayStation very good picture Excellent picture here as you can see So you can set the kids up here to play PlayStation they can play on a nice big screen a quality picture Now the brand of this projector is called a Faltopu of course fits in the palm of your hand uh, Very compact very easy to take places set it up for the kids it does have the built-in speaker right there. See the little holes there? It does have the built-in speaker. And you had a head, headphone 
uh, jack where you could put a line out to a speaker on that headphone jack if that little speaker is not loud enough for you but it sounds pretty good it's nice to set up for the kids anyways it's only $59.99 on Amazon very cheap very inexpensive gift if you've got Christmas coming up here you want to get something for the kids uh, I would recommend this very small projector I'm going to be putting a link where you can purchase this and I'm also going to put a link for the adapter if you want to buy the adapter for your iPhone so you can connect it through this. And it does come with HDMI, the audio video uh, cord. So if y'all know anybody that needs a projector like this for their kids, a nice gift, uh, go ahead and share this video. And this has only been out about a month, so it is fairly new. Uh, these are going to sell out fast, so I suggest uh, you get one as soon as you can. Uh, this is Super Dave, y'all. I want to thank you for watching my video, and I'll see you on the next one.